Alright guys, there's loads of information out there about what the perfect workout routine is, how we can get bigger arms fast, and how our diet should look like to optimize our performance in the gym and build more muscle. These are very important things if we want to improve our physical appearance and look more muscular. I mean, at the end of the day, if you want to build muscle, we need to train right and eat the right foods. But in addition to that, we still can do a few key things which will highlight our progress that we made in the gym. We even can give off the illusion that we have more muscles than we might even have. And if you're thinking right now, hey, that's cheating. But think about all the makeup girls are wearing these days. I mean, we can't even trust their profile pictures anymore because we know they don't look like that in real life without makeup on. That's why in today's video, I will give you a few clothing hacks which will help skinny guys to look muscular and guys who've already built some muscle look even more muscular. I think it's really important to get this information out into the fitness industry because it's way too common that people who go to the gym just wear oversized clothes all the time. I understand it might feel comfortable covering up your muscles because lots of people including me back in the days have body dysmorphia and they only feel good if their muscles aren't exposed. But I can tell you guys, if you start applying the tips I'm going to give you in today's video, your body dysmorphia will disappear. These things are a game changer. Personally, I've got most of my compliments on my physique since I've applied these things on myself. So I can tell you from my own experience, these things actually work. For those who don't know my background, in my earlier days, I also struggled a lot with building muscle. I felt very insecure about how skinny I was, especially my arms. This was also the reason why I started working out and improving my looks. And whilst being on the journey of improving my looks, I've learned a lot about clothing styles and what actually makes us look bigger and stronger. On this note, let's right away start with the first principle which will enhance our physique when you're wearing clothing. And it's avoiding baggy and oversized things. As I mentioned earlier in this video, it's very common in the fitness and bodybuilding scene to wear oversized things. But personally, I think it's a huge waste. I mean, why train hard, sleep right, eat right and do everything to build muscle to then just cover it up in a baggy shirt? The only time when you should be wearing something like that is maybe before going to bed, but otherwise you should be showing your muscles. And one of the best types of shirts that you can buy for that are stretchable shirts. They're oftentimes a bit tighter and they don't get loose when you have been wearing them for a few hours. I hate it when I wear a shirt which feels tight on my sleeves in the morning, but after a few hours of wearing it, it gets loose. It always feels like I've lost some muscle during this time. Im thought this isn't possible, we shouldn't be wearing material like that. I mean, loose shirts don't make us look muscular. So, rule number one is wearing stretchable shirts. There are even some shirts who have a band at the end of their sleeve. These are the best ones. If this band is tight enough, it almost blocks a bit of the blood flow to your arm, making your arm look more veiny. I know this sounds crazy, but if you've ever been skinny or are skinny, you know exactly what I went through and how bad I wanted to look muscular. And this is something which helped me for that. Then rule number two is about the color. You might have heard that the color black makes us look thinner and white or other bright colors make us look heavier. This is a trick I've been using so many times and it's really a game changer. I've made experience that when wearing a shirt where my arms are exposed, it's better to wear black. This makes our body look thinner but our arms bigger. I mean, even skinny guys don't want to look heavy around their stomach area. They just want to have big arms and a good chest and back. So to achieve that, go for black shirts. But on the other hand, if you're going for a long sleeve or compression shirt, go for white and all of these bright colors. Otherwise, your arms are gonna look skinny. I can tell you, if you have body dysmorphia, just buy a white compression shirt and it will be gone. And also try to pull back the sleeve a bit to your forearm, because this will give off the illusion that you have a shorter but thicker forearm. The longer our sleeve is, the longer and thinner our arm looks. So by shortening it, it will look stronger. Great, now you know which tops will make you look more muscular and which will take away your body dysmorphia. But it doesn't stop there. I mean, our legs are also a big part of our physique and oftentimes also a big insecurity. Well, it definitely has been one of mine. 
Therefore, I've already thought through all of the options that we have and I've tried a bunch of them and now can tell you guys which is the best color and fit for our shorts, trousers and jeans to give off the illusion that we have big legs. Alright, my go-to are beige chinos. Here's a picture of them if you don't know how they look. The reason why these are my go-tos is because they are not too tight and not too baggy and their bright color enhances the look of my quads. I think at this point you've probably made the experience that black skinny jeans are one of the worst things that we can wear if we have chicken legs. I mean the black color makes us look thinner and then the tightness of the jeans doesn't make us look muscular at all. But on the other hand, baggy jeans aren't ideal either. I mean they just cover up everything, which isn't good. And skinny guys oftentimes have pretty good definition on their quads, so there is something that we can work with. So, your go-to should be a regular fit, maybe tight on the quads and a bit loose on the calves if you have the same genetics as me. Then combine this with a bright color. I really like beige, but you can also go for white, it's just a bit harder to keep them clean. Otherwise, light blue jeans are always also a good option. Great, these are the principles that I apply whenever I buy new clothing or choose my fit for the day. They help me to overcome body dysmorphia and feel less skinny. So I can promise you they will help you as well. If you found this video helpful, please like and subscribe so that more people who struggle with this problem can watch it. Then thank you for watching and see you in the next one.